Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another episode of Rim World, Two World, or Two Stoves, not Two Worlds. What am I thinking? Last time, we decided it'd be a great idea to get a bunch of food. Oh, uh, what else did we do? Oh, there's never, oh yeah, we built batteries. Uh, I think that's really it. Oh, we also bought a new party member. I forgot about that. We bought a party member. Odd as that is. We also ran out of steel. How did we run out of steel, you may ask? Well, we decided to build these little fire poppers. And that will ensure that if we have fires, it will put them out and we don't all have to die. So, put them in every room. Now, you might say, that's a real kind of a waste considering how small these rooms are, but fuck it. Fire safety is important. There's no, there's no cause greater. <laughs> I have lost so many worlds to, uh... I've lost so many uh, colonies to fire. Usually because of explosions inside of the colony. Usually because something shorts out, or something blows up, or what have you. Um, and then everything catches on fire, and your colonists run in to stop it. And then they all burn to death. They don't rest. Finish mining the steel, at least. And haul it back. <laughs> Stupid colonists. But yeah, so that's usually what ends up happening. Usually the reason that fires start is because, like, some of the wires you put down short circuit and everything burns up, and next thing you know, uh, next thing you know, everyone's dead because they all ran in to put the fires out, and instead of putting the fires out, they all caught on fire. So, you know, standard stuff, really. Um, it's also good to keep your crops from burning down. So, we're gonna hope for the best. We're gonna hope for the best. Okay, so... A shit ton of plants. I wonder if I should have put the rice right there, if I should have put more corn down. I don't know. Honestly, I'm wondering if next if next year, after this ends after this growing season ends, if um if I just scrap this sort of setup and instead do like only corn. Um I'll have to figure that out. Okay. Please don't run in front of the gun. There you go, okay. Normally, I'm not a huge fan of, uh... I guess I'll have them finish digging this out, just so we'll stop running over here. Um, uh, should probably... Oh god, another bear. Of course there's another... Of course there's gonna be another bear. Well, there's lots of bears, oh god. Um... Okay. Let's restrict everybody except for... Silver. It's our hunter. Before we do that, okay, first bear is over here, so we're gonna hunt that bear. We need to turn the guns on. And as soon as she gets over there, now we're gonna have her hunt. Now we're gonna have her hunt over there. That's gonna be the plan. Okay, this time we're gonna hope she doesn't get mauled like she did when uh, you shot that cougar. Okay. Shot, you shot it, now run. Run as fast as you can. Hopefully you can outrun the grizzly bear. There you go. That's what I like to see. Okay. Okay. Uh, the other bear was up here. Okay. 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 <laughs> a little worried there for a moment, but I think we'll be okay. Uh, one colonist is idle. Orange is idle, huh? Um, I don't have to mine out anything over here, so... We'll have to be idle for a couple moments while we, uh... Okay. Craft you, run. Run far away, go for the best. There you go, that's what I like to see. Okay. Grizzly bear problem fixed. I can go back to what they were doing. I mean, I suppose they. Oh god, there's another one. Never mind. I won't go back. Uh, never mind, I was wrong. Oh wait, unrestricted. Where'd you go? Saw you. Oh, there's a boom rat too, so I'll hunt the boom rat. But the bear is more important because the bear will chase us. 
I don't have like a pulse rifle that I can use to kill it like instantly. A bigger problem. Bigger problem is lack of weaponry. Okay, good, it's asleep, so it's not gonna be moving. Can you, how do you miss a sleeping target? Not once, but twice. We've got a chunk of spacecraft. Awesome. Claim it, deconstruct it. Hey, come on, it's sleeping. Has it moved? Just kill it. Oh god, you, you, why did you hunt that? Uh, that's bad. You're using a shit ton of power while I have you do this. Okay, we researched hospital beds. That's good. Um. Mortars would be good, except for the fact they're, like, super inac inaccurate. Smithing's pretty good, uh, but I want hydroponics, I think. Well... Might want to get Devil Strand, actually, but if we get Devil Strand, we're going to want to grow it in the hydroponics, so we'll get hydroponics first. Although it takes a shit ton of power, that's the problem. Where are you going? Hunting grizzly bear. Don't you want to bet you're going to get halfway out there, take two shots, and then go, oh, well, it's time to go to sleep. How are you missing? There you go, okay. Run faster! <laughs> Gaining on you. Run quicker. Get out of the way. There you go, okay. Oh, wait, it's not dead, is it? Oh, shit, it's in shock. <laughs> You actually have to go and finish the job. <laughs> Again, how do you miss from point blank range? There you go. Okay, so now we can unrestrict everybody. The uh, bear disaster is over again. Of course, the bears will find a ton of meat, so. I mean, on one hand. Well, on one hand, they're very dangerous, on the other hand, they're very tasty. Good wargs. Now, I can only imagine what it's like for this ecosystem now that I'm hunting all of the predators. But, uh, I don't particularly care. They're dangerous. Actually, the wargs aren't even dangerous, except for that one time they were starving and attacked me. So, you know, normal everyday problems. I have so much meat. We literally have so much meat. I, I think I need to, like, start, uh,. I have so much hay, too, for no reason. Is the hay be... Yeah, I still... I might have to build, like, a second freezer, like, over here. For, like... The stuff we don't need. Like, all the hay, for example. Like, the hay, the human meat. Stuff like that. You know what? I might just do that. I might, I might have to, uh... Do that. That might be a project for down the line. Compact and machinery. Awesome. Except it's not steel, but... Hey. More components is always good. What are you doing? Oh, you disassembled the uh, the thing up there. That's good. Why are you injured? You got in a fight with a turtle. Why do they keep getting injured while fighting turtles? Turtles must be like the most badass animal in this game because every time they're injured, it's always be something's injured it's because they decide to fight a turtle. And the turtle kicked their ass. Like, that's... Then again, the turtles in this game will just eat meat. I don't know if turtles in real life eat meat or not. I don't know. I've never had a turtle. I've always wanted a turtle. So, turtles always seem like a lot of fun. They live forever. You know, live for like a hundred years. They'll be old and, you know... You, could, you should buy like... That'd actually be an interesting thing if you bought a turtle for like a newborn. It's young and shitting its pants. The turtle's young and shitting its pants, you know. Then they both go old together. You go back to getting old and shitting your pants because you're like 200. And they're old and shitting their pants because they're 100 at this point. I mean, you know, good bonding experience. But uh, I suppose that would also mean that if the uh, if you died before the turtle, does that mean that you'd have to do with like that, like the Egyptian burial practice where you bury the animal even if it's alive with the uh, with your owner? I don't know. That seems a little wrong to me. <laughs> Seems a little wrong, and then I don't know who I would give the turtle to. Like, do you give the turtle to your children as, like, remember me, children. Remember me as you remembered my turtle. You'd be like, Dad, we don't want your turtle. 
Nerd will keep shitting all over the house, and we're like, yeah, well, you're gonna, you're gonna have to take care of him when he's old and old and infertile, just like me. You know, things like that. Speaking of being infertile, another weird thing that I saw the other day. Apparently, uh, I didn't realize this, but apparently they they're starting to make uh, female Viagra, which. My first question when I heard that was, I thought, why didn't they make it before? <laughs> like, really? Like, why would you only make it for men? You'd think they would have been like, well, you know, why don't we make it for both men and women so that way we can sell twice as much product. Like, inclusivity means more money, so I don't know why you'd want to limit your prospective money. Uh, you're quick, pretty quick at... We have a mining of two and you're faster than the one-armed guy. I mean, I guess because you have both your arms, but still. Meat do we really have now that I think about it? 6,000 meat. Jesus, so much meat. I should probably switch this over so that I have like a second small freezer, maybe like over here. Where I can put all this shit I'm not actually like using or eating. Whereas that would mean I'd have to like... Why didn't you put it, why'd you put all the steel towards the batteries, guys? I thought you'd stick it to like this, which is already like already needs to be built, but apparently not. Hey, more rice. That's always good. And more medicine, even better. Hey, more food is good. As long as nothing spoils. As long as nothing spoils, we'll be okay. Uh, but that's what these are for. You're back to digging, looks like. Good. What if I should, like, hunt more? No, I shouldn't be hunting more things. Keep going, you know, maybe I'll hunt things. And then I'm like, yeah, you know, maybe I shouldn't be doing that. What are you doing? Yes, pick up the wood. Oh, that'd be good. We have 4,700 wood, so... You left it with 80. You left it with 40%. Cloth parka worn by him deteriorated away to nothing. How's our, uh... How's our thing going? Well, we need to make six more parkas anyway, so... Not too worried about that. We want more trees. How are these growing, by the way? 27% grown, 33% grown. And we... It's gonna take frickin' forever to grow, man. It's like forever. Jesus. Um... Cut all the trees. Cut all the trees down. Hunt all the squirrels. To spoil nature and all of its bounty to us. Spoil nature and everything you could possibly want from it. What? Finish doing your fucking your job. Walks up, walks all the way there, walks up to it and goes, Yeah, you know, maybe not. Not those two, why not? They're small. I don't mind hunting the small creatures. I really want the, uh, like, the muffalo and the deer to, uh, to sort of, like, multiply as best they can. Like, if the muffalo and the deer are multiplying, that means a nice, steady, set, you know, steady, uh, supply of food. We're good travelers. Um,. Maybe even the alpaca, but I don't really care if the squirrels multiply. Like, the squirrels multiplying is, you know, not really high on my list. You know, it's kind of like the hares. Like, they can multiply, but, like, it's not a huge sort of, you know, sort of problem. Of course, they also eat all the grass, so... Maybe I shouldn't be, like, fucking with the ecosystem. What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? They don't even want to trade, they're just wandering by. A weird little event. Okay, break down, steel auto door. Oh well, whatever. God, we have so much food! It's so glorious. Hey, you guys, Orange, what are you doing? Going for a walk? No, how about, how about instead of going for a walk, you haul the corn? Haul all the corn. Actually, I could probably put, like, another freezer, like, right here. Like, this could be our second freezer, but I don't know where I'd put it. I would actually probably heat up the inside, though. That's the only problem. 
That's the only problem, is it would heat up the inside, which I don't want. They're cutting down all the trees, that's good. Look, more squirrels! Okay, at least you're hauling the wood. Hey, we're doing pretty good, all things considered. I don't even know what Silver's doing. God, I can't wait to be able to dig through all this stuff and see what's inside. Hopefully delicious, delicious, uh, steel. Note for all the kids watching at home, don't eat steel. It'll ruin your fucking teeth. All the wood, damn it. <laughs> Leave the wood sitting around, actually do something with it. I sort of wonder if, uh, if getting rid of all of the, uh, the predators changes anything. Bulk goods guy, awesome. This is exactly what we need. But none of our guys are at all sociable. Two, one, four, two, two, one. Wow, you're all terrible social, so it's gonna be your job. You talk to the bulk goods trader. Alright, what do we got? You want wood. Well, you actually, you just want normal stuff, so I'll sell you the marble, I'll sell you the granite, uh, I'll sell you all of the slate. I don't need it, I can always make more. Um, you sell medicine, but it's horribly expensive. You sell plast steel for a cheap price, but it's still expensive. Um, let's sell all the things that we can't build anything out of. So, like the beaver skin, the boom rat leather, um, the hair leather. You have monkey hide. Uh, buffalo leather, we can probably make something out of. Squirrel skin. York. <laughs> the Yorkie skin. Um. Human leather, yeah, we should probably sell the human leather. Um, we sell components, we'll buy the components. We will... You could buy insect jelly, but I don't think we really need to. We'll sell you the hay for 15 cents each. Ugh. Very cheap, but I don't really care, I just want to get rid of it. Uh, we need to sell the human meat. Apparently they'll buy that. Uh, what else can we sell? We don't need... Army doesn't want to sell all the meat. Uh, we should probably sell the insect meat, because that's really not food. I mean, I guess you could consider it as being food, but... Um... Kibble? I guess we can keep 100 kibble. Nutrient paste. Something I've never used. I've never really seen a need to use nutrient paste. Um, let's get rid of the simple meal. We can make new simple meals, uh, first of all. What else can we get rid of? Actually, you know what? I'm just going to get rid of all of this. Like, all of the uh, leather, because we have cotton. Like, we have cloth. We have 1,200 cloth. So, really, what's going to serve us more? Leather, or... You know, what's going to serve us more in the long term? Uh, 574 bearskin. Yeah, that's something we should probably get rid of. Um, do I buy all the medicine? It's 14 medicine... That, like, cuts us down for, like, a thousand. It's so expensive. Yeah, it's only, like, actually, it's only, like, 400. Okay, um... We could sell the cloth, but I don't really want to. Potatoes, rice, berries, corn, human meat. Uh, is there any, Do I really want to sell any of the meat? Not really. The only meat I want to sell is, like, the scarab meat in these things, because I don't know if we should be eating that. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I could buy the chocolate. Um, not very nutritious. Do anything? It's like this. Seven gluttonous. Not very nutritious. So that's .01 nutrition. No. Surprise kibble is so so uh worth so much, honestly. Okay, sell the simple meals. We'll take the silver. But now that we did that, we're gonna edit something. So we're gonna edit how they uh no, don't allow rotten, don't cook with okay, you can cook with uh meat only. Um and you're not cooking with human meat. They don't wanna since we have so much meat, there's no reason to cook with uh any sort of vegetarian or animal products. So, the simple meals will all be uh, meat. Meat based. Except for, of course, human meat, because why would we eat, you know, why would we eat other humans if we can avoid it? Uh, but the fine meals, since they require both, 
we'll work with that. Animal products, yeah, don't don't eat fertilized eggs. And uh, same here. Okay, so that's fine. That is fine, and it got us a whole bunch of silver and medicine, which is nice, as well as components. So everything seems to be going very well. I'm also experimenting. I don't know if people want these episodes to be, like, longer than usual, because I was trying to make them around 20 minutes, which is about right now. Um, and I was wondering if I should make them, like, 30 minutes, because not much happens in 20 minutes, usually. Usually 20 minutes feels like a very short episode in terms of how much progress can be made. We immediately get Capybara skin, of all things. Why is Capybara skin falling from the heavens? I also kind of wish you could play as like a tribal society. Like, I feel like that'd be kind of a fun little option down the line. Like, you could play as one of the tribes, like, living on a rim world. That'd be kind of fun. Um, you guys are not going to haul any of this, are you? This is all ready to be basically harvested, so that's not a problem. Uh. So much meat. So much meat. 6,000 meat. No way we could ever need that much meat. I guess... More cargo pods, alright. Well, that's a... What we got? Alpaca wool. Interesting. Well, whatever, I suppose. Still mining, aren't you? Okay. At least you're now mining the steel I need you to mine. Um. God, there's boars everywhere. Jesus. I think hunting all of the, uh... All of the... All the predators may have caused a slight... Actually, it just gives us a shit ton of meat. That's really what it does. This means that we end up with a ton of, uh... A ton of squirrels and rabbits and stuff. Squirrels everywhere. Just hunt everything. Good, there's glorious steel here. Exactly what we needed. That's good, good. It was all the steel we could ever want. Break down fuel. Again, I don't know why the fuel generators keep breaking down, because I'm not using them. I guess they're just falling into disrepair. It's the only thing I can think of is why that comes up, is that they... Like, if I had to explain why they broke down, I'd have to say that, like, maybe they fell into disrepair would be my... My guess. Okay, that's up. So that, le that leaves just this one. That leaves just this one to be built. It's fine. Um, we have 3,000 silver. Not bad. Tempted to spend it on the guys to make them like us more, but there's no real need to... Like, there's no real need to make anyone else like us unless we're calling in their reinforcements. Um... Again, not a bad thing. It used to be how I would deal with, uh, with, like, it was an event where robots drop down, where essentially, like, a mechanoid, uh, ship part crashes. And if you attack it, all of the mechanoids pop out and start roaming. Um, and the way I used to solve that problem was, I would spend lots and lots of money. Oh, silver and gold merit, re silver rejected gold's merit, marriage proposal? Really? I thought they were lovers. What do you mean they rejected your marriage proposal? You're lovers. They're lovers, why? I guess she just doesn't want to get married, man. It sucks, but... Truth be told, there are worse things in the world, I suppose. Where are you going? Long alpaca wool. Okay. That's fine. Not all of the alpaca, alpaca wool, apparently. Oh, good, more wargs. More warg fur. There's animals everywhere. God, we're gonna have even more, even more, uh, even more meat. 
Even more meat. Not so much meat. What's your, uh, your mining at? At three. You're very slowly learning how to mine. You're not even interested in mining. You're just the only one who can do it at the moment. Or squirrels. Gotta get rid of all the squirrels. The plus side will have steel, which is exactly what we need. Unless no one ever builds that uh, fire popper, which we need someone to build. Alright, come on, come on. Speaking of fire poppers, uh, they want to build this one? Okay, they actually built it. Never mind, they already built it, so... Now everything we get is surplus. That's nice. What are we doing on connected raid? Well, it's night time, so it doesn't really matter. How do you not hit a sleeping target? I mean, it is raining, but... There you go. See, not that hard. Oh, there's rabbits everywhere! Okay, I thought that was a dead one for everyone. Like, oh, we can haul it! No, it's not dead. It's... Crazy enough, I think turtles are on the list of animals that will, uh... Hunt all the squirrels! Despite the fact we don't need any of this meat. We have literally more meat than we will ever need. I probably should have sold a bunch of this meat to the, uh... Uh... We're already back to simple meals. Army wants to start building even more. You know what? We're just gonna set this to build. You know what? We're just gonna have 60 lavish meals at this point, because no reason not to. Cargo pods. Oh, even more. We got more meat! Just what we always needed. I don't know how we're gonna live. We don't have enough meat. We need more meat. More meat, because, you know, we didn't have enough before. Give her all that silver, or all that steel. It's already middle of summer, that's not bad, actually. <laughs> okay. I'm actually kind of curious. What's your, uh... You have a shooting of 13. Got visitors, oh well. I don't care much about the visitors. Oh good, even more food. Pretty sure I have enough food for like a colony that has way more people. Raid? They're attacking immediately, uh oh. Shit, yeah, uh Everyone's Everyone's forced to be at home, first of all. Second of all, turn the guns on. That means you, Emerald. We should be safe now. Now we'll have to build more guns. Wait, are they- they're attacking my visitors. Well, that's fine, you can- By all means, fight amongst yourselves. Decided to kidnap who they can and leave. Um, okay. Well, they left somebody behind. What do you got? You're incapable of nothing. You have a green thumb and you're jealous. You're only 20 years old. Um... Your social is six. You have the highest social of anyone else, and you want to be social, no less. You're a lore keeper. That's kind of cool. Um, man, they just abandoned you, didn't they? It's like they're kidnapping people, though. It's fine with me. All right, turn the guns off. Uh, yellow, I need you to go and uh, capture him. Go capture him. Take him home. Hey guys, we got a new one. We got a live one. Need warden. Do we, do we not have a warden? Oh yeah, my warden died. That's true. Well, uh, chat and recruit. Give him medicine. Red, where are you? Kind of bleeding to death, Red. You, you might want to treat him. As far as I need a warden too. Uh, who has the highest? You have a one. Give it two. You have four. I'm pretty sure you're going to be our warden now, because you have a stat of four, which is higher than everyone else. Jesus. Congratulations, you're the warden. How many injuries did you have, man? Oh god, you had so many injuries. Luckily, you didn't lose anything, so you should be mostly okay. 
Oh, yeah, that reminds me. I should probably set them off to no longer be restricted. Not being restricted. Go pick stuff up. No, 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 no. So, or, oh, wait, there's another one. The squirrel's dead. I want the scout. <laughs> More visitors! <laughs> Just what we needed. Emerald, what are you doing? All the survival meals. Eat all the things. Pick up all the things. Heaven forbid we don't keep these dead bodies in our freezer for fucking ever. Jesus, I can't believe we're gonna need even and we're gonna need an even bigger freezer. The madness of what I'm saying of us needing even a, yet another bigger like. The freezer is already gigantic. There's no reason we would ever need a freezer that's even bigger than the one we currently have. Uh, but fuck it, we're gonna we're gonna give ourselves an even bigger freezer. And since everyone seems to be going to sleep now, we just survived that raid. Uh, I'm gonna call it here. It's already been like 30 minutes. So next time, we're hopefully going to uh, recruit this guy once he gets better from his injuries. Um, we're gonna build a bigger freezer. Maybe build a secondary freezer to move all the shit we don't want in here. Like, move the medicine, like, over into the... Actually, you know what? Let's move the medicine into here. Um, before, I, before I end this episode, let's move the uh, medicine into there. Take the medicine out of here. Free up some space in there. We're going to move the hay into another... The hay, the human meat, uh, probably the human leather, too, into another one. Maybe even the kibble, because we're not going to use that. Actually, there's no real reason to build kibble now that I think about it. We actually don't need the kibble. We don't have any animals. Um, and I'll probably keep all of that in a secondary freezer. But anyway, that's for next time. So I'll see you all later, guys.